seriousness this is what i think I, i'm not sure um some of us can be a little you know we're a bit traditional so it might not sound so good but in a way i do agree with people we all have a crazy past and um nobody's perfect nobody's perfect at all you need to have a conversation with the person and what other people i think didn't bl- bring in or didn't even talk about is the fact that talking to someone about it somebody who'll be a mediator who'll be neutral on both sides to help both of you get through it would be very good like having a counselor or something is very very important you love her like one of the, the listeners on caller said you should have a conversation with her talk this thing through and see how it is. Nobody's perfect. Charlie, we've all seen though. And God has forgiven us and brought us this far. Because some of us, even not for good. Mm. You understand me? So it's up to you. It's your decision. If you decide that you can't go on with it, nobody can fault you. But if you really want to, then you have to go all out and forgive and stand firm on this decision that you're going to do. Being devastated about it, nobody's faulting you for being devastated or hurt though. Not at all. Yeah, you're human and then you're feeling, you have feelings and your your emotions are coming out. Quite understandable. But you need to think through. You don't have to take a rush decision on this one. You have to be sure of what you're going to do. You have to be really sure of what you want to do. And speaking to a psychologist or a therapist would really come in handy, my dear. Really, really come in handy. This is not a one-time decision that you make because you're so like, upset or you're so sad or emotional about it. No. Take your time. Think about it carefully. And when you do make a decision, it's still your life. And nobody can fault you for making that decision. And that's my two cents on it. This is Pits.